Yeah, go on, man, go on, bro. Yeah, hey, yeah, shalom, yeah. Shalom, hey, shalom, yeah. Hey, shalom, shalom, shalom. Hey, shalom. Hey, when we start off, so by giving all praise all to praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakaku Dash. Right, double honors to the Apostle Great Millstone. Double honors. And honestly, brothers in the work of the most silent in truth and in sincerity. That's right. Right, Yahweh's the real name of whom the world ignorantly calls God, Jehovah, or Yahweh. His real name is Yahweh. And the son's uh, uh, true name is Yahweh Shai. When everyone would pray, pray Yahweh Bar Hashem, Yahweh Shai, meaning Bar, meaning in, Her meaning done, Shem meaning name. That's so right. So Yahweh, the name of Yahweh Shai, right? Um, was, you know, his uh, brother was just playing this clip, right? You know, uh, uh, no more weapons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know? we, we're reasoning, yeah. you know? That's it. Reasoning on an end. That's it. You know? We're reasoning on, on the destruction, you know, meditating on the destruction of Babylon the Great America. Yeah. Which is gonna come by way of fucking fire, man. That's it. You know, thermal nuclear destruction. You know, the brother, you know, he come down, you know, bled, hey, the Wadi Al Bash and Yahweh Shai. It's good to speak about it's beautiful to bro for brothers to dwell in unity. Mm -hmm. You know, brother come down, you know, or just move home and that. But brothers come down, man, showing some love and that. And that's what we're about, man. We're about pushing this word. So we're trying to get in, you know, in that prophecy spirit. Cause that's the time that we're in. You ain't seeing about that's fucking it. eclipses are coming and that. You see the earthquakes that are happening, but you know what? We wanted to harp on, we wanted to focus on this X-Men apocalypse, nuclear missing, mi uh, missiles launch scene. That's, That's what the fuck is going on, man. <laughs> we're going to focus on that. That's it, because you know? the, these are the times that we're coming into, man. Yeah. Right? We're coming into that time. We're coming into a time when a, a, a great death and great destruction. Mm -hmm. uh, before, before we even got here, we were talking about these elites want chaos. That's right, bro. These yeah, elites want chaos. Right. They, they want they want chaos to come into this world, right? But the thing is, they think that they're in control. Mm -hmm. They think that they're going to guide the chaos into a particular scene in a particular way, not understanding that the Most High is in control. That's right, bro. <laughs> you know, and then the, 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 the end of this place of, of, that we call America is that thermonuclear fire. You know what? Since you said that, I'm mm. going to get a preset, right? Yep. Um, this is um, Second Corinthians chapter 2. Verse 11, all right, it says, Lest Satan should get an advantage of us, right? For we are not ignorant of his mm -hmm. devices. That's it. You know, because like, like the brother was going into, you know, like Esau thinks he's in control and this and that mm -hmm. and whatever. But ultimately, this is the most highest movie, man. That's it. You know, and this is why we have to be on our watch. You know, we got to watch as well as pray that we don't enter into temptation. See, Esau's got his plans. But guess what? His plans fits in with the most highest plans. That Imagine that. So he can't even escape. He can't even escape. He thinks he's doing his own thing, but he doesn't even understand mm. that his plans are in alignment with the most high's plans. That's it. Whether he wants to use weather manipulation capabilities, whether he wants to use harp and he do his own earth. Hey, he's a sword of the Lord on the left-hand side. He's being used That's it. by That's the it. power that we fear and serve on the left-hand side to do the most high's bidding. He's the king of terrorists, man. Yeah, just like Pharaoh. That, ooh, I'm going to get wrong yeah. his name. And uh, um, whilst you're getting there, it's Proverbs 21 and 1. The king's heart is in the hand of Yahweh. Mm. As the rivers of water, he turneth it whithersoever he will. Mm. 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 That's it. Hey, with the king's heart. You know, and who's who's the king of this, em this empire, the kingdom of the wicked? You know, the elites of Esau, Edom. That's it. Okay, and they, their heart is in the hand of the Lord. The mm -hmm. power that we fear, that we serve, That's we right. worship. And that's in the hand of the Lord. Doesn't the scripture say that the Most High governeth the world with the palm of his hand? Mm, 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 you know? Yeah. For the yeah, the yeah, fact yeah. that Esau's in power, hold on a minute, the Most High has set him up with the basis of men. That's it. You know what's that? Daniel's four? Yeah, I'm going to hold yeah, that yeah, too, yeah. man. Hey, and, and you know what? And, and the thing is, when we say this, we truly believe it. Come. When you were saying that, right, I was thinking of that Christian song, man. Mm. He's got the whole yeah, that's world yeah, yeah, yeah. in his hand. But in, when I was singing that in a Christian church, it was like it was something you sang. It was something you said. When the Lord has mercy and you start to believe these scriptures, opens up your mind, you start to believe these scriptures, right? Mm. Through his mercy, you actually be like, Yeah, no, he's got this. No, he's got this. He does it. You know, <laughs> he does have he the does whole this. world. He does this. Exactly. That, that's, 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 that is, you know, the power that we serve, okay. right? Okay. You know, the, Lord, the Lord's in control of everything, man. Huh? You know, as, as, you know, um, as, as, uh, the case of the um the earthquake when the false tiles in the video was like oh, I'm, doing, I'm doing what's the laws well you know something to that effect look man the lord protects his elect man mm. right in in these times that are, to, are gonna come people are gonna be bugging their head out 100 percent right? up but we have the hope that we are of the elect because we understand what the scriptures say the scripture says that the lord is going to take care of his elect so that's right it. yeah i got one this is first thessalonians chapter five i must start from the top the point's in three it says, but of the times and the seasons, brethren, 
ye have no need that I write unto you. For yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. Mm. And that's, a, that's a, the theme of this lesson today is we're going into what? The day of the Lord. Mm. Okay, because we got, we was, you know, me and the brother, you know, Rutters our mouth, we were actually, you know, reasoning about, you know, this scene that you're seeing on the screen right here with, with Apocalypse, man. You know, and this whole scene of the nuclear missiles and how it brings great joy to us because mm. ultimately when the nuclear missiles are launched, you always see it in these movies, like even in The Knowing. Remember the yeah, end scene yeah, for The yeah, Knowing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now they had it as a solar flare and that, but it's still fire. Yeah, it's fire. It was yeah. still the end and it was yeah. still by way of fire. The scriptures speak about the second death mm -hmm. and it's coming by way of fire, right? That's right. But these people always look hopeless yeah. in that time. Yeah, even yeah, in this yeah. scene, you see people just, you know, I'm not even fooling it to the point where, yeah. you know, you get them clutch with Stan Lee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah, he was yeah, clutching, you know, he was, right, in his yeah. old ass age, his yeah. wrinkly <laughs> ass. He was clutching the woman and that. But you see, this is what these people are going to be doing. They're going to be clutching each other. Yeah. Because ultimately, look, man, if you ain't in this truth, if you don't have no stability, guess what? It's just going to be you and the missiles. Yeah. It's going to be you and hell to yeah. deal with. What, that, that was one of the things the general said. Sorry to cut up, but it's one of the things the general said. What the hell is going on? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, what's, going on? The, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you're bugging out. Now, you ain't got no stability, right? It says, it says, it says, for the day of the Lord so cometh, for, you, for yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. Mm. For when they shall say, so a thief in the night to who? To those that ain't watching. That's it, yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, because it, oh, let me get that. Thing. Imagine that. Because yeah, yeah. you got guys out there that ain't watching, man. Even though you see the uh, the apostles and the elders on there, on down, the brothers, they're out there hitting, you know, blazing the word, you know, or blazing the streets with the fire, the word. The word is like an unto fire. But you got people out there on the streets, man, that, like, you're wicked of our people that they, they, they ain't woken up to this truth. They ain't waking up to this truth because the Lord don't want them to wake up. Because mm. the Lord mm. wants to fucking destroy them. So that's why it's a beautiful blessing for us to actually be in this in the know, man. You know, to speak about Isaiah 33 and 6. Wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times and strength of salvation. So if you ain't stable, then you're going to be unstable in that time. Mm. So that's why we got we got to meditate on these things. we got to speak about these things, you know. we got to actually meditate on the nuclear missiles that's going to drop on America. Yep. And the impact that's going to happen, that's going to shake the whole earth. Yeah, all these four point eight magnitudes and seven point fours, that's nothing compared to what's coming. You know? Yep. It, yeah, go on. No, 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 no. Go on, Yeah. Um, because the things I thought I, I misspelled something, so I can't. Uh... But you still getting something? I, I got more. One more verse. Uh, okay. Come yeah. Back, come. It says, "For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction yep. cometh upon them." As travail upon a woman with child, mm -hmm. and they shall not escape. That's it, because there ain't no escape. And in fact, if you could read, carry on reading in that, <laughs> right? Because they, they, like, we're talking about Isaiah 33 and 6 and stuff mm -hmm. like that, mm -hmm. right? But they, these people in this world have no escape. They're hopeless. Yeah, they're hopeless. They're hopeless. They ain't got any hope. They, you know, what do you call it? They hope in this world, right? Which is why when E comes out with the MOTB, Right, they're gonna be like, oh, we want to carry on having, you know, the things that we were doing before, but it's right. like not understanding that ease is setting you up into a trap, man. That's right. You know. That's right. I, well, it was good to speak about in the days as the days of Noah were. Mm. So shall the coming of the Son of Man be that they were eating, drinking, drinking yeah. marrying. So we know that there's gonna be people, you know, living it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. The dead party is gonna get gate crashed. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Sure. The orgy party, the, the loss of the flesh, yeah, yeah, and you know what I mean? Yeah, Just. Yeah, yeah. Boogie woogie, all of that stuff's yeah, getting gate crap. Yeah, all of that <laughs> shit. Guys that are on a down low and all, yeah, all, yeah. all these diddy niggas. Oh, hey, no diddy, you know? Because <laughs> yeah, that's the new thing now. You got guys yeah, saying no, no diddy. Because that nigga, hey, that up, nigga with his monster bed, he's got all these celebrities <laughs> bouncing around like grown ass men. You got grown ass men yeah. bouncing around on a big white bed. Oh, man, that ain't right, man. You know? Oh, and there was a, there was a thing as well where like someone was doing an interview in his house. Yeah, yeah. And then all that uh, you know, a dildo on the bed and all yeah. that, bro. Like, what that was is with, it? with the Kevin Hart. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like, but that's but that's the interview where they are. He's he was like, oh man, I remember the time when me and Usher, man, we used to wake up. Oh shit, I mean, you know, that's what he said, man. Uh, he said me and Usher, we know. Then he said, no, we used to you know, we used to make had frosted flakes. We used to fight over the frosted flakes. I remember that. Damn. Yeah. So they, you know, so this nigga, come on, man. Yeah, but 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 once again, that's what the scripture says. Uh, uh, what it says about the destruction of this place, right? Because it says, for wickedness hath exceedingly polluted the whole earth, man. That's right. 
right? Because it's sort of like I remember when the elder, elder brother said this years ago. It's like, bro, I'm like, why? You know, it's you know, it's alive for what sake. It's like, why are you gonna suck dick to make music, man? Exactly. Oh, shit, I've lost a ting. That's rocket, yeah. bro. Don't worry, don't worry. I'm yeah, gonna it's like, it. why are you gonna suck dick to bloody make music, bro? Yeah, but yeah. that's Esau's world. That's the world that Esau has set up, man. Right, and it's completely and utterly wicked. Yep. Right, because here it is. Right, uh, 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 um, you know, scriptures speak about the love of money and, yep. and all of that sort of stuff. Yeah. Right, and but that's why these niggas go into that world. Yeah. And that's why these elites, they know who's gonna sell out. They know who's gonna sell out. That's why they'll they'll follow people into uh, and be like, oh, you've got talent. Yeah. Like the guy that made the um the the video recently, what did they what did he say? He was like, look, man. I'm not um what do you call it? I'm not I'm not uh Basie was saying I'm not I'm not down with this. Right? And then guess what? He got kicked out of the party. Yeah. Probably the guy that stayed, what do you say? The, the guys that stayed blew up. Yeah. You know, because this is Esau's world and to survive and to thrive in Esau's world, you're gonna be down with anything. Right? But yeah, we're not do as that will. Do as that will, you know? Be a demon. Exactly. <laughs> but that's what scripture says, right? We are not of this world, which is why we condemn all of the things that we see in this world, man. That's right, bro. That's right. Right? Because we didn't need these things to come out to tell you that Diddy was a mo. Mm-hmm. We didn't need all of these, you know, uh, 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 hit pieces and this and that because we, we've been knowing that this was happening in Hollywood. We've been t- starting off with the post and we've been telling you this is what it takes to make it in this man's kingdom. They sold their soul. That's it. Yeah, the apostles have been teaching us this for the longest time. You know, about how these guys, you know, they, they sell, they get into the industry, you know, and it's like for the for the for the love that they want from other demons. Mm, mm. You know what I mean? They awesome. wanna be they wanna be fucking idols on the earth. Mm. They want that corruptible crown. You know, so then you know and the price that they have to pay to, exactly. to get that. You know, for that, that, that corruptible crown. Exactly. The shit they got to do casting couches True. and taking it up the rear end, yeah. man. And that's everyone. That's all of them. Yeah, they they ain't no them. one there that yeah, ain't that's a all part of them. That. That's all of them. You know? That's all of them. If I can grab this and Lord's will carry yeah, on more. in this one. Yeah, yeah. I'll grab this real quick. But because okay. it says, uh, Matthew 16, 26. For what is a man profited if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Mm. But what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? So you got to give something. You got to give something. <laughs> well, <laughs> but, what, but what is it? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> you know, that's it. Everything with Esau is that deal. They call it a, what, a Faustian bargain, I believe. Is yeah, that the yeah, word? yeah, 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 yeah. That's know? it. It's yeah, you like, made a Faustian bargain. That's yeah. what you've done, man. You sold your soul. You know, sold your soul. Yeah. You sold your soul, man. Yeah. You know, you, you signed your, you know, you signed your name in blood and shit. Yeah, yeah. They show you that, you know, what uh, Sabrina. Oh, you know what I was saying? I was thinking of Sabrina. You see, so that's, that's the spirit, man. You know, that's they, they, but they put these things in these movies, yeah, and shows and stuff because it's predictive programming. Exactly. People just love. Oh, it's just, it's just, oh, it's just entertainment. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But that's a form of distraction. But they're actually communicating with one another exactly. as well in these movies. Exactly. That's what these lesser luminaries. That's what these actors are. Yeah. They, you know, they're somewhat to to a certain point in the know exactly. of what's going. You know, they're pushing an agenda. Well, do you know what it is? The way I kind of liken it is like when when the Lord opened up our eyes, we wanted to tell people, we wanted right. to say, yo, 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 hey guys, hey, hey, you know this is gonna happen. Whatever what they call you, leave little clues. I was like, oh yeah, you know, like uh, you never know the economy yeah. might crash, and you just <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you put a little, yeah, you put a little sign like, because we like sometimes, hey, but you know, bro, I, I agree with you. I like to, I, sometimes I like to fuck with people like yeah. that. You know what I mean? I like to ruin their fucking parade. Could you at least we get sick and tired of looking yeah. at you people walking around walking all proud, proud? You know, yeah. your chins up in the sky and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, all of that. Mm. Quiet and lofty. But you know what the scripture says? For because of their pride, you know, yeah, the city shall, shall be troubled. troubled. So yeah. the, guess what? You're going to be in trouble, man. Mm. That time of trouble is coming and then you can't run from it. There's no escape. Yeah. But that, that, the scripture says, I'm going to read on in here, okay. right? First Thessalonians 5 and 4. But ye brethren are not in darkness, mm. that that day should overtake you as a thief. That's right. That's right. That's right. And, and, and that's why once again, we've been, the Lord has had mercy on us. Because we, you know, we're preparing for the things that are going to come. And, and you know, you have people, you tell them, different people, are, one of the things I've observed through the Spirit, different people scoff at different things. Mm-hmm. Some people can see, yeah, you know, I can see that the economy is going to crash at some point, blah, 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 blah. But then they'll be like, nah, they'll never put a, you know, a thing inside you. Other people scoff at different things. Some, some people scoff at the opposite of that. But mm-hmm. we believe it, all of it. Mm-hmm. We know that they're going to crash the economy. We know that the nukes are going to fly. No, the, the chips are going to be pushed. Exactly. 
Yeah, and that's going to be the method of buying and selling. Exactly. And that no man might buy or sell save he that had the mark. That's, that's the it. mark of the beast, the chip. That's it. You know? Hey, hey the implants mainstream media, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guys are fucking playing computer games with that the implant. Yeah, 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 yeah. This ain't no yeah, joke. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, shit yeah. is... Bro, hold on a minute. So the apostles had it right. That's then right. shall it be known that a prophet had been among them. That's right. So these are, these are basic scriptures that we've, we've learned over the years. That we, the apostles have taught us. We're telling you now, look, bro, if you don't believe this truth, you're going to be out there. That's it. Where's, where's going to be your stability? Where's your defense? Yeah. And you're going to be taken. Right. Yeah. That's right. And you're going to be taken because one, one of the precepts of what he that shall seek to save his life shall, shall lose, lose it. it. And one of the things that the Lord has allowed us to see is because you can imagine people are going to legit be like, if I don't take this, then I'm going to die. Mm. Not knowing that taking it, they're going to die. <laughs> wow. The Lord's fuck. Well, he got you. You know. Checkmate. Checkmate. You niggas are checkmated, man. There's That's nothing it. you can fucking do, That's man. It. Because the, through the spirit, one of the things that the, the apostles never made it rosy for us. As right. in, in, in turn, what I mean by that, they never said, oh, it's going to be easy, it's going to be great. But like, that's that smooth thing. That smooth thing. That's what the Christian church. That's see, it. these pastors, slick, adultery committing motherfucking pork suckers. That's what they do, man. Okay, they get you in there, they, they want you to put the money in a collection plate. It's all about numbers with them and that. It's all about looking slick. Yep. You know what I'm saying? You know, they've got the nap, the, 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 you know, the handkerchief, this. Wiping yeah, the sweat, yeah, 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 sweat yeah, beads yeah, off their yeah. fucking glowing foreheads. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's all about the concerts, the mirth, and the smooth things because they want you to keep coming back. Exactly. See, the thing is, this ain't about being fucking popular, man. Mm. First of all, the scriptures speak about the Lord is dealing with a little sanctuary. Yes, the scriptures speak about the, the, the narrow way that leadeth unto the life, the broad way that leads to destruction. See, hold on a minute. The Christian church, that's that broad way. Because mm-hmm. ultimately, man, yeah, a lot of these. Destruction, yeah. yeah. That's it. That's going to lead them to destruction. And if the blind, blind leadeth the blind, they should all go into the ditch. That's it. So that's these guys, man. But you see, the Lord is dealing with that little sanctuary, man. That's mm-hmm. why, see, the Lord, like, let's like just speak about the straight gate. This is about a position of difficulty that mm-hmm. we're in, man. Mm-hmm. Like, when you come in the strip, it's about suffering, ultimately. Because, you know, it's about our purification. That's why the Lord said, what? Thinking not strange. Mm-hmm. As though, some, mm-hmm. you know, some strange thing has happened unto you in a fiery yep. trial. Yep. It's all about that fiery trial arc here, man. And it's building us up. But what exactly. you see on the screen right here... Hey, when the, when the, wait, hey, when the day of the Lord comes, the scriptures describe it as a dreadful day of the Lord. That's it. Oh, you well, know? It's like, not to cut you off, but that's... No, nah, you, you got what, it up. One of the scenes in here, the one you're talking about earlier on with Stan Lee. Yeah. Where it's a bright, beautiful day. Lovely day. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, so yeah. There it was, day. there it was, there it was. You passed <laughs> I'm it. I'm going to start it from here, you know what it is. Yeah. But I'm going to mute it because I don't want to get a strike. You know, is there the nukes, man? Yep. You see the nukes? Yeah. What's going on? Yeah. This is the guy's. Yeah. What's, going what's, what's going on? What's going on? You know, I'm muting it, Arkin, because I don't want to get a strike. You know how it is. Yeah, do something. But look, look and Xavier. Yeah. You see, Professor Xavier, he looks stressed. Yeah. Now he's supposed to be one of the top fucking mutants, one of the top fucking X Men, mm. but he's stressed as fuck. Yeah. But guess what? Apocalypse. Guess what? He's controlling the nukes, man. That's it. That's it. And then fucking missiles are gonna fly, man. That's right. And there's nothing that anyone can do to stop that. That's the second death. Why are they putting it in these movies? Mm-hmm. They're putting these things in these movies because, look, bro, these things are going to happen. Yeah. And if, if they weren't going to happen, why are the elites building deep underground military bases? Exactly. Though they dig into hell. Exactly. Why and they, that, why they, they yeah. Prophecy. Exactly. Amos. Mm-hmm. The Lord said, though they, what, to bind their kings with chains mm-hmm. and their nobles with fetters of fucking iron, man. That's right. That's right. Okay, so these elites, they're going to be actually in these little retreats. When these nukes hit and that, they know what's going on. Why did they even build the nukes? Because the Lord created the smith. Yep, yep. This is what people don't seem to understand. We, you read earlier, the king's heart is in the hand mm-hmm, of the Lord. Mm-hmm. So the Lord is the one that's really orchestrating all of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the army. This is a part of the Lord's army. That's it. When you're seeing these nuclear missiles flying, they're going to hit their destination. Joel, the second chapter goes into that. They should not break their ranks. Mm-hmm. They're going to hit their target because the Lord is going to actually guide them to their target, bro. That's and this it. is the time that we're coming to. So the scriptures speak. What the the prophet good. spoke about this, bro. Mm-hmm. The prophet Isaiah, what well, Isaiah nine and five. For every battle of the warrior yeah, yeah, is with yeah, confused yeah, yeah, noise yeah. and garments rolled in blood. Yep. But this shall be with burning mm-hmm. and fuel of fire. Yep. What's that fuel of fire talking about? Yep. That's coming by way of the nuclear missiles yep. and Yahweh Shai and the and chariots. The chariots, yeah. And even before we get to the nukes. The conventional weapons they have these days are crazy. Yeah. The conve- yo, yo, even, even you look at some certain of these conventional weapons that they have, 
it's 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 a it's it's crazy. Yeah. Right. The, the, when the scriptures talk of in Revelation six and four about Esau being the sword, <laughs> know, you know, being given the great the sword. Great sword. Yeah, that's right. Yo, this man can do stuff with even when the convent, but the nukes is just like the, the Lord wanted to just make right. a scene. Right. And Habakkuk three when it speaks about. Oh Lord, yeah. Was he? Was he? Was he I'm gonna get that for you, <laughs> bro. I'm gonna get that for you. I'm gonna get that because that's a, that's a beautiful scripture. Yeah. Yeah. Pro- hey, the certain prophets and when they saw that. When they were showing certain visions, yeah. man, they were like, "Yo, Lord, I, I don't yeah. want that." Shit. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Wait, Ezra, Ezra, Ezra's like, "Woe is me! Woe is me! Who shall deliver me in those days?" But, but you see, but that's the fear of the Lord. That's see, that's it. wise, and yeah. yeah, that's why this says the fear of the Lord mm. is actually the beginning of wisdom. Like, there's nothing wrong with fearing the King of Terrors, bro, that's it. That's because it. he's the one that's bringing yeah. that pain. Yeah, we yeah. want to be protected. Yep. See, but it's so, the seed of the righteous shall be delivered, right? Mm. The hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be, you know, yeah, go unpunished. Punish, yeah. But the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. So that's our hope. We want to be delivered. See what you're seeing on the screen? Right here. This is what you're seeing on the screen. The nuclear missiles that are going to fly. The Lord is going to deliver the righteous from that. Mm-hmm. The impacts, you know, the knock-on effects of what's going to happen. The earth reeling to and fro. Yep. Like Japan, they just issued a tsunami warning. Off of the back of the 7.4 magnitude earthquake that happened in Taiwan. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see what I'm trying to say? So there's earthquakes in diverse yeah. places. These things are happening. Yeah, how was I prophesied this was gonna happen? Yeah. Now, if you don't believe that, that's because you are a fucking arsehole. Yeah. And the Lord ain't open, he ain't tapped into your spirit to receive it. Yeah. It's we'll as simple talk, as that. We'll talk a bit, if I, so if I can add to that, come. you get certain people like, yeah, but there's always been earthquakes. Yeah, bro, come on, bro. <laughs> bro, not on this scale. Not on this scale. To the point where it's back to back. Bro, what about Turkey and Syria? Yeah. You had fucking what? 50,000 plus people dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Lord took them out. Yeah. What, what about the, uh, what was it, when the when the, when the the dam broke in like North, that one of the North African countries right. end of last year? And like in one night, 10,000 people just dead. There you go. That was the original numbers they gave. Like, and who, yeah. and to who who belongs to issues of death? The Lord. Lord. So this is what I'm saying. God's good all the time. You know this? Bro, hold on a minute. Yeah. Amos 3 and 6. Yeah. Shall a trumpet be blown in a city yeah. and the people not be afraid? Yeah. Shall there be evil in a city and the Lord yeah. have not done it? Yeah. So when there's something that goes down, it's yeah. the Lord that does it. Yeah. You hey, know? Hey, Christianity's got a lot to pay for, man. Hell yeah. You know, because that whole it, uh, it said God is good, it's good all the time. Yeah, all the time. <laughs> you know, because uh, Charlemagne and them try to get on Candace Owens because she didn't know the saying. Because uh, they said to her, God is good. And she's like, yeah, she's good. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, oh my gosh, she don't know the saying. And yeah, you've never been to a black church. And it's like, but that's the lie that they push. That's the lie they push. You know, that Christian lie because... You know, they say God is good, but it's like, what, have you read the Old Testament? Hey, you see? It, 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 that's it. It's called it, yeah. And like Benjamin said, I lie, I tell. <laughs> you know, yeah, Benjamin's going to call her out. I lie, I tell her. That's a lie. Hey, the Lord's got vengeful spirits created, that's it, man. That's, it. that's in Sirach 39, that's man. It. What the fuck are you talking about? The Lord, bro, hold on a minute. The Lord flooded the earth. Yeah, real Don't talk. you know about the flood? Real talk. Don't they, what about Sodom and God? What about the five cities, man? Yep. That the Lord left smoldering. Yeah. Pillars of salt. Mm-hmm. What about that? Sodom and Gomorrah, man. Yeah. The Lord destroyed those five cities as an example. Mm-hmm. And then when you got people involved in Sodom to this very day, yeah, yeah, yeah. it was an example as unto those that after mm-hmm. should live ungodly. Yeah. We're living in the after times. Yeah. But okay. That's, so like, but that's Esau's pride. Because huh. this is what you know about Esau. You know Esau's gone to Iraq and done the. Oh, did, did that shit ever? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, did, it, did it really happen? You know, he, he diligent knows, search. Yeah, he's performed that diligent search. He knows it's happened. Mm-hmm. But what do they say? The definition of insanity is doing the same thing twice. Expecting different yeah, results. Yeah, expecting different results. And that's what this man has done. He's, he knows that that happened. He knows that the law brought judgment. But not only has he done that, mm. he's gone. He's he's gone mad with it to the point where. But I saw I saw a clip. Mm. Of some judge, I only watched like two seconds of it. I was like, "Look, man, you know, certain things." Like, I, I was like, "Bro, brothers don't need to see this." <laughs> I was like, I "Ain't gonna yeah. share this shit." <laughs> but it's it's in a courthouse in America, mm. right? And it's a fucking male to female mm. thing, like male to female transition. I was like, "Bro, but you're supposed to be in a position of." Like you, you, you know when they talk about character witnesses as blood, you're not, you're not. Sound mind. You're not a sound. Yeah, come you're on. You're not a sound mind. Yeah, you're reprobate yourself. You know, but yeah, that that was um a, a lawyer representing someone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
you know, bro, I'm not, if, you know, Lord forbid I'm in a situation where I, I, I gotta turn up to court, but you, if I see you that, see I'm a like, transformer like, I'm like, bro, I don't, I, nah, bro, get me someone else, yeah, bro. Yeah, no, 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 come on, man, unsubscribe. <laughs> you know, you gotta you got unsubscribe from that, man, you know what I'm saying? You know. You know, but, but there's, there's things that the elect are gonna just be calling out that's like it, it is, man. It. Hey, the scripture says, am I therefore become your oh, enemy yeah, 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 because yeah, I, tell I tell you the, the truth, truth, man? If you don't that's like what it. we're saying, man, then you can fuck off, man. That's it. Because ultimately, look, man, what we're, we're not speaking our own words. And that's the thing that you need to understand here. We're telling you the words of the scriptures. Mm. All right. And I'm about to read Habakkuk. You quoted yeah, earlier. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Because it's the spirit. Because I was thinking about Habakkuk like for the last couple of days. Well, even at the camp. I, was, I wanted to speak about this as well. You know, Habakkuk 3. Prophet, hey, the prophets and the men of the Lord, right? There were certain prophets. And when they saw certain things, they got shook, man. Yeah. And that's and that's and that's beautiful because older than a minute, the fear of the Lord is the beginning mm. of wisdom. There's nothing wrong with fear in your how about I was shy. First of all, the scripture says, knowing therefore the terror of the mm, Lord, mm, mm. do we persuade men? That's it. So this is why we do what we do, because older than a minute, we ain't just out here do as our will in. We're out here fearing the Lord. We're doing the work because we fear Yahweh Bar Shemi Shai, man. That's it. Okay, and that's the, those are the true names. Alright? So I'm gonna read this, okay? Habakkuk chapter 3. Verse 2, O Lord, Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, I have heard thy speech and was afraid. Mm. Even the first part of that verse alone, yeah. just to hear the speech of the Lord. When you hear the prop, I remember when I was, well, hold on a minute, Oxford Circus. I saw brothers out at Oxford Circus. You was one of them, huh? I see this brother, he was teaching out at Oxford Circus. He came in before me. I heard him, he was out there teaching. The brothers, the elders, they were teaching. Elder Ramar, okay? He was out there teaching. Elder uh, Rakaya Kwan, okay? The elder, uh, you know, Elder uh, Rakama Kapash, you know? Elder Paya Allah, all that. They were out there teaching. They were blazing the words of the Lord. I was holding a minute, and I saw the sign. America's going to be destroyed. I said, what the fuck? Wait, wait. Yeah. I said, hold on a minute. What's going on here? What's going on? I said, hold on. What's let me take on? a step back. <laughs> I said, hold on. Let me take a step back. Because hold on. Is this the same Bible that... Because I, I had a Bible, I've had, I've had the scriptures, my, my, my father, my fleshly father, he brought me the scriptures, he brought me the scriptures for my 19th birthday, I remember. And we don't fucking deal with birthdays, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell it like it is. Yeah. He brought me the scriptures on my night, I turned 19 so called, right? Now check this out, I always, everywhere I moved, I always kept that scriptures, I always kept the scriptures, mm. I always put it, like I always cherished it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I never really grew up with him like that. You know what I'm trying to say? So it was like what he got me, I cherished. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm trying to say? So I kept it with me. Now, that was the same scriptures I used when I joined the camp. Okay. That ended up, said it was the spirit. The Lord set it up. But I'm going to tell you this. I saw the brothers holding up the sign. America's going to be destroyed. Mm. I said, hold on a minute. Hang about. I said, what the, wait, what the <laughs> fuck's going on here? Yeah. But guess what? The truth of the matter is, it's in the Bible. It's in the scriptures. That's right. That's America, right. Babylon the Great is going to be destroyed. And it's only going to take the Lord one hour. One hour. That's in Revelation 18. So that's yeah. why we're reading what we're reading. Yeah. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull that. I'm gonna pull up screen save one. I'm gonna pull it up. Okay, but I'm gonna read. You. I'm gonna continue reading this, bro. Yeah. Oh Lord, I have heard thy speech and was afraid. Oh Lord, Yahweh, revive thy work in the midst of the years. Mm. In the midst of the years, make known. In wrath, remember mercy. That's it. That's it. That's our hope, right? Mm. We want mercy. Yeah. Now, how are we going to get in mercy if we ain't doing the things that the Lord wants us to do? Mm. If you in that do as I will spirit, if you want to eat pork, shrimp, commit adultery, you want to do what you want to do, look, man, we ain't fucking stopping you niggas. Yeah. Oh, ultimately, yeah. look, yeah. Yeah, I wish I said it straight. Yeah. Those that were not the I should reign over them. Bring him. Bring him and mm. slay them before me. Now, I don't want to get slain. Okay, now, hold on a minute. If we got to die, let it be for the word. Yeah, wisdom, the third chapter. Right. That was good. <laughs> no, but you, you know, you, no, you got it. You got it. Uh, no, no, I don't mean to you know? you know, take your fight. Who's the biggest? What were you saying? In the, in the yeah. sight, they seem to die. They seem to die. In the yeah. sight of the unwise. Yeah. I mean, in fact, since you said that, I'm going to get it, bro. Okay. I'm going to get it. I'm going to read it for you up. Okay? Wisdom of Solomon from the top, verse 3 and 1. And it says, But the souls of the righteous are in the hand of Yahweh. Mm. That's the first part of the verse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah so yeah. we got to believe in that. Yeah. The yeah. souls of the righteous are in the hand yeah, of Yahweh. You know? That's why, brothers, you got to have faith. 
to know that the Lord is fucking like the Lord's dealing with us, man. Mm-hmm. Through the spirit and power of the Alba Shanel Shai, we could be out there doing anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do as thou wilt in it up, be diddy, you know, no, you know, diddy in it up. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. we ain't doing that, bro. Yeah. Why? Because the Lord's got us in this. Okay? It says, and there shall no torment touch them. Mm. In the sight of the unwise, they seem to die, and their departure is taken for misery. Mm. That's it. You know, people, when they when, when they see these things happening, they think that, oh, yeah, you know, it's because he was evil, because he was wicked. No, Scripture says self or not as an evil do. That's right. Right? You know, and that's, that's one of the things. We know that hell is going gonna, is gonna to come to this, you know, a bad time is going to come to this place. But we hope that if we are to suffer, that we're suffering in righteousness. Okay? And there are going to be men that have to, um, uh, uh, you know, lay down their life, you know, for this truth. Right? And we understand that. Yep. But the thing is, what does the scripture say in 1 Corinthians, the fourth, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, no, but, you know, the dead in your house. 1 Thessalonians 4. I got you. Don't I'm hold it. Yeah, you let know. me read it. This is 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verse, I'm going to start from 17. Then we which are alive and remain, right? Mm. In fact, let me start from 16. For the Lord, Yahweh Shai himself, shall descend from heaven with a shout. Mm. With the voice of the archangel and with the trump of Yahweh, and the dead of Yahweh Shai shall rise first. That's it. That's it. Yeah, the dead, you know, so those that lay down their life, right, for Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, they're going to rise with Yahweh Bashem, with Yahweh Shai, man. They're going to come back in the chariots, right? They're going to come back in the chariots with, with the Lord, man. That's right, huh? Right, and that's that, you know, that's a beautiful thing. A scripture says, Greater love hath no man than this. That he laid down his life for his friend. Mm. Right, and Yahweh Shai then followed on and said, Look, I'm your friend. Mm. Right, and that's oh, why he laid up. Precious in the sight of the Lord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The death of his saints. That's it. Mm. That's it. Mm. You know, so hey, if, if, we, if, if, if some of us have to, which some of us will, it's in the prophecies. Right, it's written. So it's, yeah, it's written. Some of us are going to have to have our, you know, our heads. Uh, removed for this truth mm-hmm. right so be it but you know you're gonna have people that are gonna be like oh you see uh uh, uh where is your god it's just like how they scoff the yeah, was shot. yeah mocking him yeah he oh he others. saved others yeah he <laughs> saved it. that's his yeah, spirit that's bro spirit. he saved others yeah. himself he cannot save exactly. that's what they said about yeah. him man but you niggas are gonna pay that's why hey man yeah, yeah, even yeah. those that pierced him yeah yeah yeah, yeah. you niggas still like it bro you yeah, gotta be yeah, man yeah. you gotta be emotional with that <laughs> you know because uh, I'm thinking like, bro, like how they're gonna they're gonna try and paint us. They're gonna have us on the news, mm. breaking news. This man, this and that. You know, Esau. We know you got your your media and that. Yeah. You know what I'm trying to say. But guess what? If this council be of men, it will come to mm. norm. Yeah. But if it be of most of the most high, you cannot overthrow it. Gamaliel said that Acts five and thirty eight. Yeah. That's see. This is the thing. The message that we're coming with. You can't stop you this. Can't stop it. You see yeah. the nukes that you put in your movies, man. Mm. That are flying. You can't stop that, bro. That's it. Because it is written. That's right. It is written, and 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 it, even from when you try to, you know, the, uh, um, I mean, the word I can't use any other word, but when you cut Japan with those two atomic weapons, mm. that was that was something that you had to do to to get that, you know, to get that dominance in the world. Because people start looking at America after that, like, oh shit! Mm-hmm. Right in the back of their mind, they're like, yeah, we fuck with these guys. Well, that's the hammer of the whole earth. Yeah, how, how spirit, I was thinking. Yeah, but that's, oh, that's yeah. the spirit. Let me get it. Yeah. Let me get it for you. <clears throat> yeah, let me get it. Yeah, hammer of the whole. Yeah, because Japan's never been the same since, man. I was saying uh, I was with reason with someone else as well. It's like, bro, when you when you look at Japan, right? Japan was a brutal fucking empire. Mm. You know, excuse my French. Japan was brutal as hell. They were doing the most. Mm. Yet after they dropped them two atomic weapons, Japan's just anime boys and girls. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, you know, but but that is the power of those weapons. That is the power of, that the Most High gave to this man, mm. right? Once you mm. quoted it earlier on Isaiah fifty four sixteen, I have created the smith that blows the coals and the fire, mm. and they were able to then go to the rest of the world and be like, you know, flex that might. Flex, yeah, you that's know, right, that's right. But one of the things the elder said at the camp yesterday was how it's a, 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 a beautiful, poetic, even. That America was the first to use those weapons, but will be the last nation those weapons are used on. Yeah, you know? The Lord see, see the Lord's making good in his word. Mm. That's why hey, Isaiah 55 and 11, 
So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. That's it. It shall not return unto me void. But it shall prosper, you know, it shall establish that which I please mm. and shall prosper in the thing whereto I have sent it. That's so it. the Lord's got his word prospering. There's nothing that Esau can do outside of the bounds of prophecy, man. That's right. Because this word, because the Lord spoke it, that's why it is. That's it. He is mm -hmm. Yahweh. That's, that's it. it. The fuck you, man. All you scoffers and scorners, all you guys that want to come up against his truth, you guys, you, you're done, man. Okay? You're marked. And that's why we're signing and crying. Okay, because ultimately we see what's going on out here and you niggas out here, you, you're distracted. You want to be in this. You want this place to continue. But guess what? We don't want this place to continue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we're being, we understand that we're being oppressed. We understand that we, we're, we're looking for a new heaven. And I'm going to get that scripture, Second Peter 3. Mm. Okay, but I've got this one, uh, Jeremiah 50. This is Jeremiah 50 and 22. A sound of battle is in the land and of great destruction. How is the hammer of the whole earth Cut asunder and mm -hmm. and broken. Yeah, 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 yeah. How is Babylon become a desolation among the nations? That's it. That's it. And we can't wait for that. And uh, if you can jump down to, um, in fact, if you can read read the the next two verses afterwards, because I had, I had uh, twenty five uh, a lo uh, loaded as well. But like, yeah, if you can read the next two verses, but it's 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 it's, it's going to be a question. That's right. You know, how? You know, yeah. Yeah, how, how? You know. That's the hammer of the whole earth. How, how, America? They spend like seven hundred six to eight hundred billion dollars a year on their military. Mm. Yeah, the Lord is going to done them off in an hour. Yeah. Right, because the Lord is going to be with it, right? I mean, the Lord is going to be in those missiles when they're flying to America. That's right. Right, scriptures so talk about none, none shall thrust them through, right? You ain't going to have no missile defenses that which, because, hey, once again, when you, when you, when you look at um the Ukraine war, what it, oh man, there was a day when one Russian Kinzel, mm. right, basically it's a hypersonic weapon, took out an entire Patriot missile system. Oh, yeah. They're shooting off missiles, trying to stop it. Couldn't stop it. <laughs> Couldn't stop it. Right, and that's once again, that's one of them hypersonic. I wasn't a nuclear payload or, or whatever, what have you, but I was like almost like a foreshadowing of things to come yeah because they ain't no stopping it ain't no stopping <laughs> <laughs> we're on the move <laughs> 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 oh, we, we're about to get down <laughs> if we close out we're gonna, we gonna get down man you know we're gonna, we're gonna toast to the destruction right, of this yeah, place that's it this makes us excited exactly. you? You, we see we ain't out here wallowing in despair oh. at the shit that's happening no this is this is uh, boosting us, spirit, like, yeah. it's uplifting us. Because we're looking for and hastening to this, man. man. I don't think you people understand. See, you people out here, you clinging on to nothing. Mm. We're clinging on to a new kingdom. That's it. Yeah, our shy's kingdom, bro. Man. That's what we're clinging to. A new heavens and a new earth wherein dwell of righteousness. Because you people want to upload, uh, you know, upload. You well, want to uphold wickedness. Well, and you know? upload it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Real. yeah. 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 <laughs> and, and that's what it, they do. They they upload, uh, they uphold and upload, upload wickedness. Don't <laughs> you know? be just on a yeah, putting on TikTok or that's putting it. on the OF, and it's just like, bro, what the hell is going on in this world? Real talk, bro? real talk, real talk. <laughs> you know, that's right, brother. I got those two verses, right? Yeah. So it says, I mean, verse twenty-four. Yeah, it says. It says, I have laid a snare for thee. Oh, and if I could stop you there, because once again, he thinks he's in control. Uh -huh. When he's doing all of these things, like, for instance, you know, you're speaking about the bridge earlier on, right? You oh, know, he's, he's thinking that, oh, yeah, I'm going to do this thing, and then X, Y, and Z, and I'm going to control the people. But what would I say? But when we see that, should we get excited? Yeah, that's it. That's it. You know, people yeah. are trying to be like, oh, yeah, like we were saying, oh, yeah, it's because of this and that reason. It's like, all right, bro. Yeah, what, yeah, all yeah, these breakdowns and stuff. You see all these deep breakdowns? Like, yeah, yeah, come on, guys. Listen, bro, we understand ultimately, no matter what the breakdowns are, we are ultimately, that's the king's heart is in the hand of that's the Lord. It. Esau, he can only do the things that the Lord... See, we brought out earlier. Mm. The king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. That's it. As rivers of water, he govern it, you know, whether it's whether he wills. Yes, so the Lord, like, he's directed everything. There's nothing that don't go down without the Lord sanctioning exactly. it, ultimately. Exactly. And that's what gives us great comfort. Exactly. Okay, but you guys are out here wondering, well, what if this and what if that? Yeah, yeah, we ain't yeah. out here wondering. We yeah. just know that. Bring on the chip. Bring on the chariots. Yeah. Bring on salvation. You see, 
ultimately end fucking game. That's it. You know what I'm trying to say? That's it. We're in that end game mentality. That's it. Yeah? You got that fucking end game mentality. You guys out here, you're playing for the now. Yeah. Fuck the now. Yeah. We're, we're playing for the end game. For the end game. We want salvation, Arkham. Okay? Because we know there's better to come. Right. These people, they think that this is it. And at certain times, you know, you stop and you're like, man, these people, legit, they just think that they're just going to vote Labour this year, then vote Conservative <laughs> yeah, in four yeah. years. And then, you know, hopefully they'll have their pension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, perfect. <laughs> you know. You're perfect. Yeah. Not understanding that there's a better model, mm-hmm. right? And that better model is Yahweh Bashem Yahshah's model. Okay. You know, because this place will say, this is it. People will see, uh, you know, the the, 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 the the screens and the, you know, the, 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 the vehicles, the you know, implants. <laughs> they see all of that thing and they, oh, like, for instance, the, like, my man had to go into that, the one that got the Neuralink. Mm. He had to go into the surgery. They were like, oh, it's a trial. So he would have had to sign off their paperwork. So yeah, if yeah. I die, it's okay, whatever. What did you, how should I do? Right. Do you believe? Alright man And that was it <laughs> Yo Lazarus Rise up man Exactly Like one of the things I think about is um The one The guy that had never walked Because Layman Act lay, 3 Yeah yeah, yeah Peter yeah, yeah. and John Yeah Yeah that wasn't even Well they yeah. called on you How was I to do that Yeah And then the guy And it's one of the things When, when people Because I've seen someone Growing up Or someone I knew That was in a wheelchair And you see their legs Their legs are through Yeah Even if they were to Miraculously walk again Right in Esau's world, mm-hmm. they would need to build the strength in their arms, do physio. Then after two years, they'll be able to walk. If that, if that. You but know? in that moment, bam! What does it say? He sprung up. He sprung up. And guess what? He started praising what? Yeah, yeah. Well, that's he started it. Pra- he started calling on a name. That's it. He was praising Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. That's it. So hold on a minute. So that that's a testimony because ultimately. The Lord is going to bring this calamity and destruction to what? And it's going to serve to magnify his, his name. name. That's it. See, see, we're in a time of miracles, mm. you know? You, Arkham, and if you, Arkwaf, that are listening out here and that and whatever, we're actually in a time of miracles where That's the Lord it. is going to start bending things. You know, you, the things that you thought was reality, yeah, 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 you, yeah. you're going to have to start holding a minute. What's going on? Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know? Let's go. Yeah, what's going on? What's going on? <laughs> oh! <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say? So your reality is about to get okay, fucking warped, warped yeah, man. Yeah, the Lord's yeah. hey, like Elder Pashai said, he said the like Ghostbusters. Mm, the Lord's mm. about to start pulling back that veil. Ghostbusters yeah, yeah, type yeah, shit yeah. starts happening out here. These people ain't ready yeah. for that. Hey, because E has basically created a world where, like, where, for instance, the scripture says, you shall be visited of Yahweh with storm and tempest. That's right. But then Esau, what does Esau say? Oh, global warming. Yeah, he's got the right. breakdown. For he's it. got the breakdown. He's got the breakdown for, for effing everything. But the Lord, he's basically at the thing where he's, we're going to start seeing things where it's like, nah, this is more than just yeah. global warming. This is more than just, you know, X, Y, and Z. This is something else. Something else, yeah. This is a higher power. Something we can't explain. This is spooky. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Good. Know? Yeah, I like you said that. It's spooky. You see, yeah. the Lord's about to do some spooky fucking shit out yeah, here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, beyond your fucking logical breakdowns and comprehension. That's it. You yeah. know? Yeah. To the point people are just, you know, they're the last people thing I'm going to have. It's, the, it's a deep fake. It's a deep <laughs> <laughs> You know, but you're going to have those that believe. You're going to have those that believe and are converted. That That's are going right. to be like, you know what? And this is one thing that's been beautiful. So if I could say this real quick, mm-hmm. carry on. It's one thing that's been beautiful about this whole Israel uh, uh, Israel war mm. is that people are now looking at E and being like, "Look, yes. we're not going to take what you're saying at face value anymore." Their image is being brought down. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Exactly. People yeah. are looking at these E's and it's like, "Bro, like, okay, you said that's what it is, but is that really what it is?" Can't. Um, you know they're losing trust they're losing trust yeah so even yeah. though as like, you know we, 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 we understand that we're gonna go through those certain things in the end anyway but it's like mm. even things people the E's gonna try put us on blast or whatever but you're gonna have people like you know what I've been past the Israelites they never did anything to me right you know they're gonna be like look I, from, from what I, the police the apostles have said it like yes. did the police have come up like nah these are upstanding citizens man yeah, well the scripture says if it all, if at all possible exactly. be peaceable with all men exactly and that's why bro cause we're see we're going 
of the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. We don't do what we want to do. We don't mm-hmm. do as our will spirit. And that's why, like, what the testimony the brother's giving, like, the police coming up to camps and this and that. We've had that, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, we've been in Oxford Circus, busiest shopping shopping place yeah. in the whole of Europe. Yeah. Bro. We've been taught out there. Yeah. We've actually yeah. been there. And, and we've seen these things. Police will come up and they just leave us alone. Yeah, yeah. Because they know that we're just peaceable. That's it. Hey, there, was, there was a lady, the, the chief commissioner, whatever role mm-hmm. she had in the Met, right? Her, her underling came up, a right Edomite. Mm-hmm. A right, he's coming up, he's trying to be all like, he's, he, he's, he, yeah, he's bullshitting, he's instigating the crowd. Do you feel threatened? Right? And that's a leading question. Yeah. Right? If if, if, if he was in court, you would, your honor, that's a leading question, whatever, what have you. And the judge would be like, yeah. Like uh, I forget what 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 the judge was saying, right? But then when the when you're the chief... badgering the witness, <laughs> yeah, 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 basically, yeah, that's it. You know these stupid terms, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> but when the chief commissioner, that mm-hmm. guy's boss, came, mm-hmm. what did she say? Leave, pray for me, and then she told them to all leave. When a man's ways please of the Lord, he maketh even his enemies to be at peace with him. Know that ark him. Hey, there's gonna come a time where they're gonna bring us before the councils, man. Mm, mm. Okay, but the Lord said, Look, say it not in your hearts what you shall utter. The Lord's gonna put it in our spirit. That's it. What we're gonna say. That's you know it. what I'm saying? So there's gonna be times of brothers, they sincere, firm believers in the Lord. We're gonna be put before these elites mm. and that. Yeah. Okay, before the councils and that, yeah. judges and that. But guess what? The Lord's gonna put that spirit upon us to do what we gotta do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, through oh, the spirit firm. to pro- you know to prophesy against them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And stand firm. Yeah. If, I, if I can answer, because what happened with Paul, right? What did Felix say? I believe yeah. it was Felix. It was like, look, man, you almost persuaded me. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know? That's right. That's right. Can I read this, brother? Can, 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 Second Peter yeah. chapter three and ten. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, mm. in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. That's right. And the earth also, and the works that are therein, shall be burned up. Mm. You know, that's that burn in the fuel of fire. That's right. Are you seeing on the screen the nuclear missiles flying? Yep. Hey, you go. Uh, uh, they shall build, but I shall throw it down. That's right. Like every you look at the London skyline, for example, all you ever see is fucking cranes. Yeah. Cranes all the time, always building, right? But that's gonna be that's gonna be taken down. Yeah. Right. Hey, even in this clip, my yep. man, apocalypse. What did he say? No more weapons. Yeah. Then he goes, no more, no more superpowers. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, but you know, see, the Lord is, oh, oh, the Lord's got, hey, the Lord's got a sense of humor, man. He'll yeah. put the spirit on these devils to put these movies together. You know what I'm saying? To pretty much, it's like a trailer of what's coming for this kingdom. Mm-hmm. No more what's superpowers. Up? And Esau, he's got the technology on the left hand side, but he's been given that by the mm-hmm. Most High. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So no more superpowers, man. It's like, hey, Janice and Jambres, yeah. when they got stepped to by, hey, because yeah, the left hand side is real. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the right hand yeah, side yeah. is more powerful. That's it. That's when it. Moses and Aaron stepped to the, to Janice and Jambres, guess what? The right hand side prevailed over there. That's right. Okay, so don't be thinking that how the left hand side. That's just, yeah, man. Mm-hmm. No, no. Mm-hmm. The left hand side, they got, they got power, bro. And they've been given that. Yeah. But the right hand is more powerful. Yeah, and the right controls the left. That's right. There you go. And what you were saying real quick, Revelation 19, 12. His eyes was a flame of fire, and on his head were many crowns. Mm. And he may, had a name written that no man knew but he himself. Now, many crowns representing Yahweh Shah coming and taking off the power from all of the kings of the earth, man. Mm-hmm. No more superpowers. Right, because when E goes down, bro, you think Moab is gonna try sneak in there? Yeah, man. yeah, come on, man. yeah, come on. Yeah, you, you know, everyone's like, oh, China's got net. No, they ain't, bro. Yeah, well, E's were holding a minute. Well, this, the, the prophecy must be fulfilled, right? Second Ezra six and nine. Mm, Esau yeah, is yeah. the end, end of the, of the world, world. And, and Jacob yep. is the beginning of it that follows that's, that's why Psalms 2 speaks about why did the heathen rage that's it, and yeah. their people imagine a vain thing. All these heathen nations, they can imagine themselves being next to rule. But it's futile. Yeah. Because Yahweh Shai is going to establish his kingdom. That's it. And that's what we believe. And that's what we know. Yeah. Because that's written in the Bible. That's it. He, he thinks he's in that, do- you know, in Doctor Strange, end of, um, uh, what was it, uh, Infinity Wars, where Doctor Strange is like, there's only one out of 12 million combination. He yeah. still thinks <laughs> that he's going to get that one. Yeah. 
Like nah, bro. It's but there's none. There's none. There yeah, is exactly. none. Yeah, so there's not even one. one. Not, there's not even one. one. <laughs> <laughs> but the Lord gave you the illusion that there's one, that's but there's it. none. That's it. There's really none. That's there's it. nothing you can do. Yeah. You know? And like that song. <laughs> Nowhere to run to, baby. Nowhere to hide. Nowhere to hide. <laughs> I'm saying, bro, how'd you get it? Because you know, I always think about that. That you know that um that that song. Yeah. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to Hide. There's nowhere to go. All you people, you scoffers, you scorners, you want to come up against this truth. There's nowhere for you to go. Mm. Okay, because when the COVID happened and that whatever, hold on, where was the scoffers? They disappeared. Yeah, disappeared. Because what we were saying, hold on, now you got to line up in the queue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now yeah, your yeah. ass is in the queue. Now you got to get yabbed. Yeah, yeah. yeah but we didn't see. But yeah. that time, actually, that was a test. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When that came out, we stood firm because yeah. guess what? Wisdom and knowledge kept us stable. Yeah. Your ass was scolding and scorning. You had no stability. Yeah. So a lot of you guys, you out there with the first, the first jab in you. Yeah. You, you might have got a booster. Blood, you here, you got fifth. boosted. <laughs> All of that, man. Yeah. Ah, now you got blood clots. Yeah. You fucking, you niggas are dying. Yeah. yeah so yeah, yeah. fuck you, man. That's it. That's hey, mate, you how about some of I was shy? Hey, Sherlock Ray yeah, Young. So it. all you fucking niggas, yeah. scoffers and scorners that came up against this word. Because guess what? The Lord wanted you there. That's it. Yeah? Because ultimately, man, to see, hey, the scripture says wisdom is the principal thing. Yeah. Therefore, get wisdom. And all yeah. that getting, get, get understanding. Yeah. If you ain't got the understanding, you're in the congregation of the dead, man. And that's what it is. Mm -hmm. You niggas are done. You're fucked. You're finished. Okay? You don't believe in the nukes. You don't believe in the chariots. You don't believe in the laser beams. You don't believe in the judgment of the Lord. You don't believe in the second death. Mm -hmm. You niggas are out there. You're That's hopeless. It. That's it. But it's better to have hope staring at what you're seeing on the screen right here. It's better to have hope in this time mm -hmm. than to be hope fucking less. That's it. And that's what we see. That's what we hope for. That's it. Because when the chariots come, the Lord's going to take us out of this oh, shit. Oh, what? One, one, one out of the city or two out of two, the city? That's two, right, yeah. bro. That's right. Phrasing. That's right. I'm gonna get. Yeah. I can get that. I'm gonna get that. What is it? It's Matthew 24. Yeah, calm. But we're gonna close out. You know, Matthew. I'm gonna. I'm gonna close out on this. Yeah. You know, this is Matthew 24, and I'm gonna start from 36, because I believe that's about the times of Noah, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. This is Matthew 20, uh, 24 and 36. But of that day and hour, know if no man, no, not the angels of heaven, but my Father only. That's it. But as the days of Noah were. So also shall the coming of the Son of Man be. Yep. Hey, hey, hey sorry, just gonna go okay. into it and I'll make a comment afterwards. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Keep going. Yeah. For as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage until the day that Noah entered into the ark. Yeah, because hey, if I could say, even when you look at the CV, where you have people doing the most to still have their wedding. <laughs> you know, it was, <laughs> like, it was like, well, we've got to just cut, like, cut the guest list down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, we can only invite like the really close family members. Sorry, you can come to the wedding. And But if these are time people that were going to come, oh, shit, yeah, I don't have to fucking pay, pay for a suit. I didn't want to go in the first fucking place. <laughs> you know, but it was, you, I don't remember you have people that were doing the most doing to the still most. have their wedding. And that's what they're going to be doing in this time yeah. when the chips push. They're going to be doing the most. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they want to keep this kingdom of wickedness alive. Yeah. You know, but the Lord's bringing it. Day. Yeah, it's gonna, but it's gonna be short lived. That's it. You know, it says, and knowing, it says, and and knew not until the flood came and took them all away. So shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. Mm. Then shall two be in the field, mm. and the other one shall be taken. It says, the one shall be taken, and the other mm. left. Yep. Two women shall be grinding at the mill. The one shall be taken, and the other left. That's right. Watch therefore. For ye know not when, what hour your Lord doth come. That's right. That's right. That's, that's why, you know, we, we, we keep an up on the news, kind of. right? And keeping and, and, and linking things in this world that are happening to the prophecies, you know? That's right. You know? You know, so that's, that's pretty much it anyway. You know, go on, go ahead. Can, can, yeah. yeah. So, hey, as always, laws what I was edifying. That's right, bro. You know? Lord and, uh, willing. Lord will. You, you know? know? Till the next time. Till the next time, say Shalom. Hey, Shalom, man. Shalom, hey, all shalom. praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakakudash. All right, Shalom to the hopeful elect. Shalom, Shalom, Shalom. That's right.